Let's see if it's working. It is working. We're live. Okay. So, I take that off. That's an old wire nut. And that's fine. I'm going to use a new wire nut. I'm going to go ahead and cut these a little bit. Just line them up. I don't need, you know, you get them too long, then it's hard to push them all back up in the box. Okay, here's that old wire again. It'll take a little bit of doing, but I can get it. Here's my new. And this wire stripper has numbers on it 10 12 14 16 18 this is 12 gauge wire so i put it in the number 12. pull that off my yellow wire nut which is a new wire nut i'm gonna hold those up there just like i did the other ones and if this see this one has just a little bit of a curve in it so i'm going to straighten that out hold those up there like that put my wire nut on there and it still amazes me how electrical works and there's always that one moment of hesitation when I turn the breaker on or the light switch on so I hope this works <laughs> you know what I mean okay so I'm gonna fold that down fold that down like that there you go I got a blank plate here. You always want to make sure. Uh-oh. What the heck? I think I just dropped my screws. Here's my blank plate. I've got to put that on there with the screws and we're done. Uh, now if you drop your screws or if they're not in the plastic bag what to do you know sheetrock screws you know, inch and a quarter coarse threaded sheetrock screws and those work good too so you know if you're up in an attic working take some little screws up there too some sheetrock screws you never know when you're going to need them see here you know what I think I I think I missed I missed the hole that's because I couldn't really see it up here get the hole there it is up in a ceiling or something where you don't see a blank plate maybe you want to save those little white finish screws for something else when you need them you know so these will work now did I lose those screws actually <laughs> I'll let you be the judge of that Wow, we got that done now. Now I've got it. I can go down and and turn the breaker back on. And that completes all my attic work, except I have to push all this insulation back into place. You know, all over here. I've got all my wiring done. I got my other junction box done over there. I've got this one done. And I'm ready to come down for lunch. After lunch, before I leave, I'll have to get back up here and resituate this insulation. Don't worry. Well, that's all I got for this time. Well, but I'll be back with more videos.